Because when you're in the world, you're of the devil, your father the devil, right? right, right. Uh, when you don't have God on your mind at all times, from when you wake up in the morning to when you go to sleep at night, you're of your father the devil. Right. I'm just going to say it like that, but I'm going to be bold and honest. You he, know? he right. Uh, I was in the right state of mind then, you know, I had some marriage. I don't think of the devil, I don't think of evil. You'd be surprised what is evil in God's eye. Um, in biblical days, just blaspheming his name, just saying, oh my God was blaspheming his name and that was punishable by death you were to be stoned and that was God's law that wasn't man's so you have no idea what God considers evil and what he considers good because a lot of people be like well he just get all the, the evil people off the earth you mean you hi you guys welcome back to Amber and the truth I'm Amber and what I do here is expose the truth the gospel truth that is in today. Let me do another reaction. This one is going to be reactions of um, Catholic reacts to Master Mason exposing the Freemasons. Now, I'll try to go to the original video of who this person is reacting to, and it's no longer on YouTube. So. Yeah. So we will just jump into it. Um, really made me want to watch this is simply because I understand the Masons on a spiritual sense are warlocks and I have a family member who is a witch on the witch side. Um, the females are the Eastern Stars, the males are the Freemasons. And I want to know what they be doing, what they be talking about. Cause my grandma just left like a week and a half ago just came back from spending a whole week with them wonder what they was doing so um yes sir i don't know who this creator is but you know what's up and welcome back to the channel man it's your boy mr twat today 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 hey, girl, girl, check, check this out man what, 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 what do we got here Ex-Master Mason exposes the Freemasons. What the what, 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 what? What the world's going on, man? Hey, we gotta check this out, brother, man. Yo, this is your first time on the channel. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe and join with Twitter. We got the same chair, kinda. Family of YouTube and that's His name, bro. Also, before we get started, started, put a like on this video. Remember, if you got a video you want me to react to, get down in the comment section let me know, and I will get to it, man. Let's go ahead and get into this reaction. Alright, brother. You said that you had also, uh, Masonic, right? Masonic. Yeah, I, I, well, my career in law enforcement, I actually joined the Brotherhood of the Freemasons. Uh, okay. Okay, how did you get into that? How did you get into that? I mean, you know, a lot of cops are involved with that. Really? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's it's uh, it's a thing that, I'm not saying you must do, but 95% of them do. You know what I mean? That makes a lot of sense because I'm like, what makes them so, so, um, I don't know when you see in like especially in videos when you see in videos interaction with cops most of my interaction with cops they've been super just extra for no reason like what is the problem like unless somebody committed a crime or they coming at you left cool put on your angry cop but if people is compliant with you talking nice to you what is what makes you all of a sudden just disrespect them it's weird now I know y'all y'all majority of y'all are warlocks good to know I mean, uh, what's the benefit out of it? Like, what, what's what's the main purpose? Of Actually, five for me. If you're gonna ask me the question, I think it was more like biblical history. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. What intrigued me the most was that you know they talked about King Solomon's temple and mm -hmm. the Holy of Holies and. I've always been intrigued by it. So this actually exists. Yes, it does. It's your cult. It's not gonna be messing with. Okay, I'm gonna tell you straight up. All right. Uh, there's three phases. Uh, first shift. I mean, the first phase is an apprentice. Okay. Uh, even before you get to that phase, uh, you got to be uh, pretty much uh, spoke about. Okay. You know, to be one, you have to ask one. So uh, one of my uh, supervisors, he was a lieutenant, um, pretty much came up to me and asked me, hey, you, you want to join a club? And I'm like, what kind of club is it? You know what I mean? <laughs> right. Well, it's a Freemasons. I did my background, you know, uh, on them and did my research. and. I've seen a lot of positive things that you know that came out uh, out of doing the research. You know, a lot of them donate money to cancer victims and children's with cancer, and mm -hmm. the Shriners they have their own 
hospital and and so forth, you know, and you know, I was in a position where I'm working with juvenile offenders, well, why not? Why not do something in the outside, you know what I mean? So uh, my lieutenant spoke for me and two other of my uh, fellow brothers in blue, and uh, they petitioned, we petitioned for uh, a spot in the Brotherhood and uh, filled out applications and um, they get a background, they do a background on you, see if you're good standing or else they won't take you. Wow. Uh, they, what they do is they take men to make them better, that's what they say. Mm -hmm. But only God could do that. Right. You know, no club could do that for you. That's right. You know, so uh, right around 2006, I'm on my fourth year, I'm a fourth or fifth year on a job. You know, I petitioned, it all went pretty good, and you know, they do a house interview. Okay. So I had. I mean, like 20, 30 people come to my house and uh, they spoke to my wife because they speak to the females first. Wow. I don't know why, but they usually do that because you're going to be, you're not going to be around as much uh, when you, you know, go into meetings or you got to do, um, you know, like uh, take time off to do um, Which craft? You know, work uh, as far as uh, donating, you know, get money for donations and, you know, and so forth. So, um, I didn't see that quite a bit, you know, as far as going out there, uh, you know, uh, doing any, that, that type of work first because you have to go through rituals first. Mm -hmm. the, the first phase is the inner apprentice phase, that's phase one, and you, know, you do your rituals, they take you in and they tie a toe to your ankle, you know, made of a toe? A toe, yeah, ankle toe, they call it the ankle toe, and it's made out of... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, it's like a harness. Okay. It's like a like a tie. They, they tie it around um, your leg and they raise your pants leg up and uh, you know you're there in a suit and then you go around. And, you know you're blindfolded. So you That's the witchcraft. Actual temple. Anybody you hear anybody say ritual is a witchcraft? They're using the things of this world for spiritual guidance. When God and Jesus and the Holy Spirit are the only real, true spiritual guidance, why? Like, why? Just think about it. Like, why are you having one pants leg up and one down for what? Now, on a, to some to some um, closed eyes and dark hearts, that doesn't seem like much. Okay, it's pants. Everything has a meaning on this earth. Nothing is just because. I know y'all like to believe that because Big Bang Theory or God isn't real. Everything on this earth is not just because it's not by accident. Our words, the way we speak, the cadence, none of it is by accident. All of it has a purpose. It's a temple. Uh, you know, you got Joaquin and Boaz on one side, you know, the two towers, uh, which is the two pillars. So the this, is, this is like big time. Oh, it's a ritual. This is this just is, like sacred stuff. Right? Yeah, yeah. But but see, the way they sh they cookie cut it is that uh, they only get the ones that are like you know, I would say the ones that are really interested and the ones that are clean cut. Right. All right. Um, and I'm gonna add the devil to this too. Okay. Because when you're in the world, you're of the devil. Your father, the devil, right? Right, right. Uh, when you don't have God on your mind at all times, from when you wake up in the morning to when you go to sleep at night, you're of your father, the devil. Well, I'm just gonna say it like that, but I'm gonna be bold and honest. You he, know? he right. Uh, I was in the right state of mind then. You know, I had some. Well, I don't think of the devil. I don't think of evil. You'd be surprised what is evil in God's eye. Um. In biblical days, just blaspheming his name, just saying, oh my God, was blaspheming his name. And that was punishable by death. You were to be stoned. And that was God's law. That wasn't man's. So you have no idea what God considers evil and what he considers good. Because a lot of people be like, well, he just get all the, the evil people off the earth. You mean you? I don't steal. I don't kill. I don't murder. But you lie. You blaspheme his name. That is punishable by death in his book. So he is very sensitive to sin. If you want all the evil people go and think about yourself. Because you're one of them. We're all one of them. We're all inherently evil. Why do you think you had to send his son to die? Because we're evil. This man speaks the truth. I had a problem. So I felt like this, this was an outlet for me to get out mm -hmm. and have uh, fellowship with other mm -hmm. brothers. Uh, yeah, right. Because you wasn't yeah. getting that with the churches. I wasn't getting that with the churches back home because, I mean, they were... 
uh, preaching prosperity. Right. Okay. You know, give me a dollar, God gives you a thousand. And God doesn't work that way, man. You got to work for, you know, you got to work to eat. So, no, nah, don't wait for a handout. So, how long did the first phase last? Uh, the first, see, what they do is they bring you into the temple mm -hmm. and they have the secretary, which is a male. We're all males. There's no female masons here. I know in Europe, I think they do, not here. Unless you're an Eastern star, that's different. But the Freemasons, the blue, the, you got the Blue Lodge, which is composed of all different nationalities and and, and backgrounds of, of, of Masons, right. to include different religious sets, Hindu, Muslim, whatever. You could be atheist, they don't care. You could be Satan, you could be a devil worshiper. Wow. And they'll bring a devil worshiping Bible, right, that satanic Bible, so you could wow. you take the oath there. They don't care. See, I didn't know that mm. until I started doing more homework on it. Now, what did I get myself into? But did you ever get that far? Oh yeah, I became a master mason. Okay. I mean, the, front, the the highest you go is thirty third, okay. but even at thirty second, that see from the ranks of thirtieth to thirty three, which is free, uh, that's when they devolve the, the the actual truth to you. I got you. You know, which they have you in darkness all those years, and then once you start climbing up the the you know the rituals and the phases, and you go up the the ranks, the degrees, <laughs> right? Call it. Uh, you could go from the third degree to the thirty-second degree in a weekend. Wow! Oh yeah, you could do it in two days. They call that the fast track. But usually, to get that high, it takes years. Wow. It takes it takes years. But you could do it the other way. You got to pay some money or talk to whoever. I heard that some people. Are, if I, I might have, might be mistaken, but I know I know some of these rich people, these Hollywood people, they get land millions of dollars oh yeah yeah it all depends because those are called dues right okay and you you talking about occultic satanic uh individuals that work in hollywood uh you know of uh, 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 you know reverence mm -hmm. of money of people of power you know um i didn't know all that because when you got scales in your eyes you can only see so much right but when god removes those blinds off your eyes you start seeing who's who for what they are mm -hmm. uh, you know, uh, and not every every Masonic lodge. I mean, we all they all talk about the same, but everybody's different. Mm -hmm. You know, because in order for you to be a Shriner, you got to be a Mason. For order you be a Knights Templar, you got to be a Mason. And you, the, the more you go up in that pyramid, and the highest you could go is a Rothschild. Right. They're the highest of the highest. Really? Yeah, they're the Satanic children of Satan. Wow. They actually sit on the table. And they have a special chair for Satan right there. And he comes and talks to these family members, and they're the ones that they're, they're shaking and bakers, I call it. Now, this one has to do also with... <sighs> Satan want to be my father so bad. He really do. He want to be my father. Like, he can't he hate him. He hates God. Yet, he embodies everything that he is. He, try, he literally copies everything. Got his own tongues. Got his own church. Got his own Bible. Got his own servants. Got his own angels. You want to be I... the uh, those people who go out into the wood and they burn that wood and owl and stuff like that. Oh yeah, you talking about uh, those uh, the Illuminati? Illuminati, okay. So right. This that, has to do with. Them. Oh yeah, you have to be a Freemason to be there. All the presidents were Freemasons. Okay. A small portion weren't, but they were Jesuits. This is the same thing. Okay. Yeah, even the Pope. They don't. Right. And they'll, I'm gonna be honest. They they don't actually have to do the whole ritual they have to watch right why well, he's so shocked power and rank within the church uh, yeah. but it's still controlled by the pope is not a man of god at all he's not they all yeah it's, everything is controlled by the white and black pope yeah. so black and white which is uh, white and black tiles is where oh, we have our temple that's where you get that yeah okay. the yin yang you know the, the right. good versus evil you gotta have one of the balance and that's the work of the devil. God doesn't work that way. He doesn't manifest that way. That's all the trick of the devil. You know, the world, the, the devil knows the Bible better than me and you put together. Right. Because he was there when God was putting it together. Right. And of course he fell. Of course. But he knows. Yeah. He could twist the word of God and make it so clean like honey in your mouth. And say, well, this guy is a man of God. But no, you got to keep, you got to go beyond that, honey. Right. You got to go around it and do your research. Mm -hmm. Because they, they're going to give themselves up. You know what I mean? A lot of these guys and women, men and women that work in Hollywood, they're all Satanists. Yes. Okay. All of them are Satanists. Yes. And you know what? Anybody could tell me different. I, I really don't care because I know. Certain hand signs, 
that you do, you know, the pyramid, the rock, you know, Jay-Z calls this the rock, it's a pyramid. Right. right? Jay-Z, he pyramid, called himself 13, my father, Ho. Right. Don't the, ever, uh, in your uh, life. Uh, well, the, that's the, the horns of the devil, right. the devil's horns, yeah. And, you know, that's Illuminati, you, you could use it for the, the shrines use it too. Right. That's the Moloch. Okay. Moloch is the actual owl that they worship out in California, all these big shots, big corporations, they go there, and that's where they make the presidents too. Yeah. They make presidents there. They know which president they're going to make. They make them. They, all this political Bo stuff, right. that's just BS. That's bullshit. Why? That is bullshit. That, that, that is the most deceiving uh, thing in America. They know which the Rothschilds makes the presidents. They're trillionaires. They own the world. They own, they own like 90% of the world. Yeah. Right. Plus, if you have all these superstars and all these... You actors, control their puppets. Well, and then now they, they got the money to buy land. Oh, yeah. And eventually, there's going to be one government, yes. or one secret government, should I say, be like uh, the Illuminati or the Masons, right. who will control all this land. But see, the, the Masons are the foot soldiers of the Illuminati. You understand the pyramid, right? Yes, yes. It's shaped like a, like a triangle, right? So we're at the very bottom. At the very bottom. And then above that, you got different families. You know, different. Uh, above that, you got York right, uh, Scottish rights, which are also sets of different branches of, of Freemasons. And then you go into Knights Templar, and, and you got, uh, you know, so Shriners. I guess that's where you get the all seeing eye from. Uh, the all seeing eye is the Lucifer. Right. Underneath them is the Rothschilds. Underneath them is the. What's crazy is he don't see nothing. You know the song, um, Santa's song? Um, he knows when you're sleeping. He knows when you were awake. So you better be good for your goodness. Like that. The words of Santa also spell Satan. The characteristics of Satan are in that song. He calls himself the all-seeing eye but don't see nothing. The, the devil is not omnipresent. He's not everywhere at once, which is why he got demons doing his footwork. Because he can't be everywhere at once. He be in one place and he sit there and he get the rapport from his demons. I... Council of 13. Or the Council of 33. Or 13. No, 13. Underneath them, you got the Council of 33. Underneath them, you got big, you know, different corporations like the CFR. Wow. The Council of Foreign Relations. And underneath them, you got you know, like six big companies that own all the, you know, all, they own all the real estate and they own all like media mm -hmm. outfits, you know, like, um, uh, I said media, um, they own all different types of, yeah, like, like those people who, uh, like Warren Buffett and all Well, people. yeah, he's a 33rd. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so they own, uh, you know, property, they own land, they Fox, own everything. Yeah. Everything. So you got six corporations in the world that owns 90%. And Disney is one of them. If you didn't know that, Disney is one of the big six, one of the six companies. And y'all think that this is for play, play? This ain't for. This ain't a game, bro. Like y'all thought. Y'all think we'd be lying and Christians be making up stuff. I don't know this man from campaign if he a Christian or not. But what he's saying is a hundred percent true. Of the assets and the money of the world, right? Mm -hmm. So even the Federal Reserve is not. Of the United States, it's a separate entity that's ran by the Rothschilds. See, the Rothschilds they run all that from their house, wow. and they live out in in England. They don't they don't leave that house. Yeah, I heard something about that. They don't leave the house. Why is that? I mean, is because that's where the devil dwells. I, I knew I knew he dwelt in England. I was like, I know he's somewhere in England. I just I just feel it like because the show Lucifer is loosely based on himself. He made that show for himself. And Lucifer, the character, is British. Why would he make himself British? Hello, he's in England. He also made himself tall, dark, and handsome. Quote, unquote, that's what white people call it. Tall, dark, and handsome. Um, 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 dark hair. You know what I'm saying? Very good looking. British. This man, he, he putting two and two together and it's me equal in four. Oh, the, the devil can only be in one place. God is everywhere. Period. Do you understand? I just said that. Um, yeah, because God is, uh, he's... He's Everlasting. Omnipresent. He's omnipresent. Yeah, he's yeah. everywhere. You can't yeah. put God in there, sir. Yeah. He's too big. And, and you can't have, you can't have the devil 
no. everywhere. You know, no. he's, he's limited to his power. One spot. Amen. Well, he'll use his foot soldiers to do other things. Exactly. Yes. They're all demons. They're all demon possessed. You're not just They're saying vessels. that. They're fleshly vessels that are uh, um, that are compartmentalized. They shred. They, they, they're like shattered. They shatter their brains, and it's just it's like MK Ultra, right? They they use MK Ultra to um, break the minds of people, mm -hmm. and then they mold them the way that they want them to go. Right. And what he's speaking is very true in the spiritual sense. Satan gets a hold of your mind, will, and emotion as your soul, and he controls you and breaks you down into your nothing to where you feel like you can't leave and you have to serve him. That's what that's the people are his foot soldiers. Why do you think the media is the way that it is? You only hear about certain things because like this Jeffrey Epstein. All them people on that list and ain't nobody went to jail. Bruh, cause they all in on it. Why you think ain't nobody like why Dan Schneider people like Dan Schneider get to just be around? Because they're all in on it. They're all in on it. They're all in on the kidnappings. They're all in on the blood sacrifices. They're all in on everything. Our world is ran by evil. And God is only allowing a little bit. He's still on his throne. Like that show that came out recently. The, the cartoon. The little demon. God cut that off the air. Period. I'm glad he did that. He, he did not allow that to see light for too long. Because at the end of the day, he's still on his throne and this world is still his. Now, the devil may be running it, but the universe is still God's. He's still on his throne and he's still allowing certain things to happen just so people can come to him and he can change them, you know, and have the spirit of truth reign over them so they can change. But for for now, Satan having his way. Only for a little bit, though. He's getting closer and closer until my father get off his throne. He inching off of it. He inching off his throne. He inching off. When I say he inching off, like how you about to get up out your seat, but you ain't really off your seat yet, he inching. You know what I mean? Our satanic ritual abuse. That's, that all comes together with uh, the Freemasons. So their ultimate goal is pretty much to have one world, one world order, one world religion, one world religion, and one world currency. Yep. To eventually rule the world. Rule the world, right. Which is to usher in also the, the Antichrist, the, the Antichrist, Mark of the Beast, and so Mark of the Revelations. Beast. So you've seen all this firsthand. Yeah. Oh yeah, firsthand. I mean, I've seen the rituals. I've seen where they they imitate them trying to kill you. Wow. You know, when you get in your masters, they put you like they they simulate that they're stabbing you, and they're killing you like a two ball cane. You know. Mm -hmm. um, so in other in other words, like you almost have to. Kind of like the way we have to be reborn. Yes, they're making a mockery out of the um, out of baptism. Of course, right. and, and it's and it's actually reversed. And you know what? The devil works like that because yeah. so if we have to be reborn, they're pretty much saying you have, you to, have to die you. first. You have you to die yourself for the devil. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So just like the you know like the satanic baptism, they do they baptize them in blood and uh, in a, like a cast iron bathtub. Right. If you see the videos that you see, like this girl named um, uh, Rihanna is one of them. She's done uh, blood uh, sacrifices and she's done a blood baptism, but they won't show blood in the bathtub. They show water. Right. But it's symbolic. The water, their water is symbolic to blood. Right. And they have to get in that bathtub. Even M.M., you see him on... On, uh, on one of those magazines, he's just leaning back, bare-chested, with blood up to his to his stomach. Wow. In a, in, a, in a cast iron, you know, uh, bathtub. And that's how they do their rituals. Everything is backwards. Who's the other guy? I know uh, There's a lot of them. A lot of them. Yeah. It was Lil Wayne? Lil Wayne is another. That's the most satanic one around. Right. Him, Little Baby, um, the one that promotes him. He's, he's a pedophile. He's a fag. Wow. Mm. Oh yeah, they're all homosexuals. They have to be like the Baphomet. Yeah. Like is it the above, Baphomet, like is yeah. it below. You see the Baphomet? Yes, yes. He's has, four arms? Something like no, no, no. That, that's Hindu. I'm talking about okay. the Baphomet is the 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 god of the Knights Templar. Okay. I'll post the picture as you're saying this. Yeah. I'll post it, the it, it's a goat's face with horns. Right. It has breast of a woman and the remaining uh, uh, lower half of a man. And then... Uh, the, the feet of, of a goat, wow. you know, so they worship that. That's Lucifer, all right? It's wow. disgusting. Yeah. They eat fecal matter, they drink urine. I mean, it's disgusting. And I, I never did that, you know, I never got that high up. You know, <laughs> like, but when you're like, you there, won't put me with and it. they expose everything to you at the 30th to the 33, you know, 
it, it's a, you're done. You're selling yourself to the devil at that point. And then, not only that, you yeah. sworn to secrecy. Yeah, you sworn never to divulge any information, but to always protect and help your fellow brother. That's wow. it. Yeah. Yeah. And oh, so yeah. That's the, that was the pretty first step. And then what was the second? The second, second is fellow craft. That's, oh, okay. yeah, that's uh, the second degree, fellow craft. Okay. Uh, same kind of rituals, but it's now you go from raising your pen on the uh, pants, you know, the trousers on the right. Now you're going to do it on the left, and now you got a different ankle toe with a ball, you know. Man, that's crazy. And then you blindfold it, it take you, you know, the actual uh, officer. They call them officers, the ushers. They call them ushers, they usher you around, and you got to bow where you have to bow, and you got to, you know, do what you got to do, and wow. and they make you face the, the worshipful master of the East, the worshipful master of the, the West. Uh, this, this specific part in the lodge, uh, it's empty, and that's the North. You never face the North, you know, which it resembles where the Lord is at. Right. You know, they say that God is, you know, Straight up north, you know, um, but they don't make you do nothing with that. Um, it's just like senseless rituals, you know, and you want your ego to get through. You're eager to get your ring, you know, your token, yeah. or, or any other, uh, you know, Masonic memorabilia that you could wear. You put it on. I've met somebody when I was working yeah. at, at the shipyard, uh, yeah. someone who did have a ring. Yeah, I used to wear a ring all the time. Okay, so yeah. they give you rings. No, no, you have to buy it, you have to purchase it yourself, oh. or if you're my brother. And I'm giving you a token of my appreciation to you because you already became a master. Right. Well, here's a, uh, sometimes I'll give you a dime with a, a compass and square on it. Wow. Man. You know what I mean? Unless you really put it up close to see it, that's a token of appreciation and love from your brother. I told him the dime? Uh, the party, uh, now I need to go look at a dime. Hold on, y'all. Oh, I got a dime. This dime's messed up. I can't tell, but I don't see it. Well, you know what? We want to buy you your first ring. Mm -hmm. Well, they'll give you a shield to put in your car. You know what I mean? Uh, so yeah. everybody sees that your brother, leave you alone. You get special privileges. You know, you get pulled over. Have a nice day. Because they're all. Well, yeah. So the ultimate goal here is that if anybody ever, I guess, approaches somebody, but stay, stay far away from this. Oh, you're going to have to stay far away from him and run. Don't stay close because see the the problem with that is they use the 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 actual word brotherhood as an advantage to them. And sad is that catchy? Is that you say brotherhood also? Yeah. Like uh, this is going around a lot in the colleges. Oh yeah, the you know the alpha cadas and yeah. all that. that. That's all Greek. Yes. Um, and a lot of them becomes uh, after a while they'll become our uh, bones and skulls. Oh yeah, especially if you're in Yale, that's where they come from, you know. But they do have that. You have to be a master mason before you become, a, you know, mm -hmm. anything else. Uh, depending on your, you know, your upward mobility, is and rituals. The quicker you get them done, the quicker things are revealed to you. But like I said, you could go as high as you want if you got money and you could buy your way up. Mm -hmm. You know, honorary. You know how many times they give honorary doctorates that people never ever been in college yeah you know like uh, for example uh, Bill Cosby got an honorary uh, doctorate right mm -hmm. so they jacked him up with some of these women and stuff they took it away but he's a Freemason oh. but see if, if you start exposing them they'll go after you they'll go after your family they'll try to kill you because the government is part of it it's not only civilians the government is in cahoots with these people right right and in every, there's sectors throughout the whole country that split apart. I, I don't know if it's north, east, south, and, and west, but they have witches that are in charge of these sectors, and warlocks are in charge of these sectors, and they pretty much monitor the 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 satanic. Uh, you know, I'm going to use the satanic. Uh, you know, uh, members. Mm -hmm. You know, like they call it congregation too. Just the, the opposite of being a. Uh, 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 Jesus believer. You know, I don't want to use the word Christian, you know, Christianity. Yeah. Um, but I want to, you know, uh, believers, right? 
So they have a specific warlocks and uh, you know Council of Thirteen witches, which are either male or female, mm -hmm. and pretty much they're in charge of thousands of members of the congregations and the local witches and warlocks that are in charge of that congregation. Wow. And a lot of them are politicians, heavily involved in witchcraft. Mm. And they have to do certain rituals and certain things in order for them to gain favor with the Rothschilds and then they send uh, orders of, 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 you know, orders of doing things for the for, for that family. Wow. You know, they give them orders and, and with those orders come money comes with it. And so, to, 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 so like, the exact same way we try to expand the kingdom of God. They're doing it the other way. They're doing it the other oh, way. Oh yeah, they, they, they're satanic at the core. This whole country is not. We don't know when it's sad though. We don't know when it's sad though. Mm -hmm. From head to toe. Don't ever think that the president is not a satanic worshiper either. Don't ever think. And I'm going to put it out there too. Even Obama. I'm going to put it out there. <laughs> nice. I'm going to put it out there. Don't ever think, and I'm gonna put it out there too. I'm gonna put it out there. Nice. I'm gonna put it out there because I mean, come on, their god is money. Yes. Lucifer. Right. They don't have none of want or need. Right. Doesn't the Lord says it in the Holy Scriptures? Ye that are poor and rich, right? We're rich in favor to the Most High. That's right. All you gotta do is ask, and God provides. Amen. If He provides for the little critters and, and the birds of the air and the fowls of the you know the how air, much how much more us that He loves us even more? Amen. We're in His creation. Amen. But these people are satanic at the core. They don't believe in God. They hate God because their God is Lucifer, Amen. and I was involved in that. I met witches before. They reveal themselves because when you're in and you get yourself out, see what got me out was. God's love and grace and mercy. So, so looking back, yeah. uh, you wouldn't change nothing in the world for Never. Uh-uh. I'm, I, 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 I'm humble Amen. to the 20th power. <laughs> Amen. You know, I would never change anything right. because the Most High has something to do with it. Amen. See, and I didn't know, I, I thought it was just things that you know at times you know you do something that you ain't supposed to do you reap what you sow yeah. a lot of it was reaping and sowing don't get me wrong but the bulk of it the bulk of it was god breaking me down from being a juvenile all the way up to i'm in my 40s now you know so i'm a different type of person now Amen. you know everything that was taken from me that i thought it was taken away from me god gave it back multiply, with interest so you know I, I, at times when i fellowship when with other brothers and sisters, you know, I, I, I share with them portions of my testimony of whatever benefits them, you know, in the walk. And they're like, how did you do it? You know, someone once told me, he said, uh, the devil likes to subtract and divide. Yeah. And the Lord likes to add and multiply. Multiply. <laughs> Just like Abraham. <laughs> Amen, brother. Just like Abraham. That's right. You know, but uh, I mean, people like yourself, you know, through you, I got to see the apostle. Right, yeah. You know, I would have never got to see Pastor James mm -hmm. if it would have been because of the word of the word made simple. Made simple, you know, on, on YouTube, and then from there we started fellowshipping, yeah. and I started watching all his, you know, YouTube channels through you, Tony Harving, right. and, and, and everybody else, and. You know, just before I came here, the Lord spoke to me. He goes, "Well, you need to be baptized. You need to be holy, brother." You got the Holy Spirit in you, you speak in tongues, now it's time for you to be baptized. Amen. Right. So from here, I'm going to go to the Holy Convocation, hopefully in July. That's right. That's and right. I'm going to be baptized there. And I got to go see Pastor Gino Jennings to see if uh, he, he knows what to do with yeah. it. Yeah. And you see, there you go, guys. You have it. Here's Brother uh, Vic. And uh, hopefully he'll be there, God willing. Hopefully I'll be there, God willing. Hopefully yeah. First God. church. Yes, Watch. amen. And uh, last last week of July. Last week of July. Also, if there's anybody out there considering to become any, uh, a Freemason, don't do it. Right. Don't do it. If you need to talk to somebody that's been there, you can contact me at 330-707-5159. Or you can shoot me an email, which is lowercase vr13377 at gmail.com. Uh, at any time, I'm available all day long. So I just want to say God bless you. So, uh, be safe. Do the right thing. Thank <laughs> you.
the top fan of the man, get down the comment, get down, get down in the comment section right now. Pause the video, get down in the comment section right now, and let me know what did y'all think about this. Do if this is your first time on the channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe and join the Wittwa family. We are literally the littest family on YouTube, and that's a fact. Also, before you leave the channel, put a like on this video. Are you serious? Did any of y'all know this about Freemasons before y'all watched the video? Because I bit. did not have no clue about this. Like, Wittwa family, y'all know throughout all of the videos we've done. What's just crazy is that the knowledge that I gained... I didn't look up. God just gives you, you know, the spirit of truth reigns over you. So you, you just know these things. There's certain things I didn't know. Certain things I did know. I know the big six was ultimately evil. They've always been. The fact that there's six companies that own everything. And I mean everything and I mean everything. Every company that exists, they're under. It will literally lead you. Let's just say Disney being the big six. Disney will own one. And they would own two, and then two would own three, and then three would own four, and then four would own five. Like, just to say these numbers are businesses. It is literally intricately broken down like that. That's how they work. And, and this whole time, they just work in literally against the grain of God. They're working against the will of God. That's just, that's, that's their whole point. That's their whole purpose, is to work against the will of God to advance their evil kingdom. Knowing he know the Bible more than we do. Knowing that he don't win at the end of this. I don't understand the effort. I really don't get it because you don't win, but you know, whatever. Where floats his boat. But, um, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for staying in tune. You know what I'm saying? If you want to continue the conversation, have any questions, put it in the comments below. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button so we can be in the algorithm so more people can see this video. As always, I will see you or you will see me next time. Peace.